Alright, what's up guys? As always, welcome back to another, well, randomized game as um, the OU-ish part was necessarily not working. There were a lot of players there and I got myself in an Ubers game, so I kind of gave it up. Um, let's see. Yeah, this is great. It is an Ubers by technicality with Gengar, but besides that, this looks great. Not a big fan of Brelum, mainly because I used one myself. Um, Tort, however, should be able to uh, deal with that kind of fine. Actually, Tort looks great for a lot of these mods. Huh. Galactus will struggle versus Tyranitar, then again, which Pokemon doesn't struggle versus a Tyranitar? Shensei is great, Yeltis is great. Actually, I'll lead off with Yeltis. Um, mainly because I think there is no way he leads off with, um, with the Breloom, right? He saw my own Breloom, and you don't want to do that. I should be able to get my rocks up for free versus a Tranitar. Or if card shop is switching. I'm just ice beaming because of the sugar berry. Um, besides that, like like I said before, I have a blast with teams like this that are subpar. They're not they're good enough, but it, they're clearly struggle and uh, sometimes it can actually work. Let's see. He sends in Yes! Now I just needed to fall for the bait, buddy. Come at me! I'm gonna ping you. I'm gonna bust your brain up. Yeah? I have no idea what I'm saying. Quake me! <laughs> I mean, fall for the bait. Fall for the bait. I actually have bulldoze. I have every reason to think this is an in game team because of that. Don't I? Still, it's gonna get me a minus one, which will be tremendously awful. Actually, bulldoze might just be a, a strat. Bulldog is not that terrible, however, this chomp is... Oh! Oh! Ho ho! No! I am in such a journey right now. <laughs> Why? Why did this have to happen to me? Not only do I bring him down, I get him frozen, and I get four in the same turn, that's, that's not possible. Or it's very possible. Um, Alright, fine. <laughs> Still, we need to bulldoze again. I'm at minus one, so I'm not too solid. Um, I probably should have gone for a kill. It's still a strange scenario, for sure. Oh, he switches out. Nice. Goes into. Oh, I mean, I couldn't tell. Reloom. Oh. Well, great minds think alike, right? Go Jax! Come at me, bro. Come at me. Oh, you're you're toxic, Corp. You're gonna lose this matchup. <laughs> or it could still have Mag Punch, though. It's it, it's a thing. I mean, Optimize for Rock 2 more Mag Punch, so it's kind of weird. I think the Fable is kind of safe for him to bring in. He could be just the sun, it should still hurt. I know I just could have actually switched out, but if he has facade and I'm still in like, I can't beat this Brilliant head on, that is. That's a good switching on him. Withdraws, I get that. Clefable is so safe. Yeah. Let's see, how much does this technician boost the force palm do anyway? I think it did alright. And yeah, port. I don't believe it can do anything to me besides um, Thunder Wave, right? That should be the worst scenario. Yeah, I'm clearly misjudging it all. So, I don't know if he gets stored power this generation or not, but he can still cosmic power through this. I'm pretty sure Gunk Shot does a whole lot anyway at plus two. It's not the best scenario. But that goes for me too, like if he gets a full cosmic power boosted, then I have no idea what to do. Yeah, he withdraws, I get that. Two... Yeah. That's fine. And he clearly had to make something like that. I just need him poisoned, that's all I need. Come on, Tort! Get him! Wish I'd brick break right now. How can I not get him poison? That's like a 60% chance. 
because I have Giga Drain for Swamp, but that's it's not going to help this time. Um, do not enjoy switching into this mod at all. Honestly. Bringing Jax, uh, mainly to Spore, actually. Or I think Bullet Seed could be kind of fine. Kind of hope it goes for Rocks. Or Stone Edge is fine. It's going to hurt, but it's fine. But, like, Spore is a fair play, but I think Bullet Seed just make more sense. Because every switch in, even his own Breloom, is going to struggle versus that hit. Brings in Clefable. Yeah, if I get a good roll, then they should ruin it. One. Oh, it's a crit. I was like, wow, they did a lot. That looks more like it. Oh, Citrus. So, can we get five, right? That's, that's, that has to be a goal. A few crits there, and we're all, all of a sudden in a great scenario. Oof. Damn it, Jax. I like... Don't want to take too big of a risk at the same time. If I get three hits in, it's dead, right? One. Come on, Jax. Crit or free? We're doing free. Fine! Clefable is out. That's a phenomenal situation. <laughs> All right. You'd be sure he fainted. I would too. Um, however, I am in Muck Punch range for that freaking his own Breloom if um, that were to come in. I mean, I clearly sack Breloom from here, right? It is at a scenario where it's very, very scary. But also, Breloom. <laughs> A focus punch Breloom is not something I want to deal with. And it should be carrying Mag Punch or Facade. Ooh. But you're not scarfed. No. Sorry, that's not it. <laughs> yes! Only hit him once like a boss. Now I clearly revealed for him exactly what I am. So um, here comes the Breloom, right? Though I have every reason to think his Breloom, since I didn't bring it, he probably doesn't have Mag Punch. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah! Kobo! <laughs> My man! The boss! Let's go! I need this to work somehow. Psychic. Oh, that's cool. You ever been noped? Looks something like this. Yeah, I got a quake. And if Breloom comes in, I still got a Quake. I don't want a Quake, I want a Fire Blast, to be honest. He could carry Focus Blast, but I should definitely be able to soak that. And if Tyranitar comes in, it's, it's not coming in. It's gotta be Breloom. Let's see... I mean, it's a series of Japanese names. As far as I care, I have no idea what they are. Yeah, that was a poor play. So just Fire Blast, Rice Beam, really. And I mean, he has Poison Heal. He is, in theory, without worry. <sighs> yeah. Port. Like, he should be able to carry a facade, but I think it's just gonna um, substitute. But just, I can't, I can't make that call. Spore. <sighs> he carried Spore, that's nasty. So Spore, Poison Heal. Alright. A Grass Move and Focus Punch, right? He is thinking though, I cannot like that. I 
And Sleep was a good play, like, he had a lot of options of just not making a tough call. This works for him. Tarantor's gonna come in, and um, I'm just burning a turn. And thinking about how I should go about this, really. Uh, Stone Age is definitely gonna hurt me. He could be having Quake. And somehow need to break him apart. I don't want to bring Jax straight on at it. Oh, he has Quick Claw. Nice. <laughs> what a reveal. Like, okay, you're gonna get out. I'm just gonna tell you right now. I'm gonna fucking ruin you. <laughs> Stealth Rocks. Fine. Just the burn alone should, you know, be more enticing for me. I badly, badly want to actually ice beam on the breadloom play, but fuck, he he did it. Uh. Yeah, I'm ice beaming. He could have mag punched. Okay. So this is what we do now. We're sporing everything. Fantastic. Smoking rules are for pussies after all. Not great. Alright. Let's find out if he has it. Mag punch. Alright. Wake up, Kiltis! Yes! Yes! Piece of shit. Oh, and he lived. Because why not? Then it's Sandstorm Roof. No! That's not right. That's not right at all. Oh, um, fuck. <laughs> no! Oh, come on, Tort! Get out stomach this hit, really. Oh, he respawned. This is a mad lad. He knew what was gonna happen to him. He knew it from the second he woke up. Now, I really hope... Um, I mean, I have no place besides... Like, I want him to stay in so I can wake up and Shadow Sneak kill him. That's my play. It's not a very strong one. Gengar. No, I mean, this guy. I honestly just need to wake up. Tort, you're not helping. His neutral play should be just... Yeah, Yeltis, you're out. I barely want to set up my rocks, but that's not an option. Um. I really hope he goes for Stone Age and miss, right? No. Because, <laughs> I mean, in theory... He can just straight up lose his Tyranitar if I want to. I kind of want to spore myself, honestly, but... There's really no reason to. Bullet seed here. Thing is, if Gengar comes in, I should be able to start, at least hurt it quite a lot. He's gonna get kind of close. I like this. All of a sudden, there we have a Breloom game, and it's just about the Brelooms. He has. You want to sack your Breloom? Do you want to bring in Gengar, hoping it's stomach two rounds, or do you want to sack your Tarantar? The options are infinite. He stomached this really well. Come on, one more hit, Breloom. Yes! Get wrecked. <laughs> okay, but I know what's coming. I know what's coming. It's the Mac punches and it's the Shingamabob that I don't want to deal with. And if Gengar comes in, I mean, I'm clearly out of options too. 
Yeah, he brought the loom. He's gonna make the easy play, and so am I. Because if I can wake up this turn, I should be able to. I mean, I have no idea what's happening from here. I just hope he mag punches. Yeah. So I'm gonna get like a boss! Because I'm a fucking muck, man. I'm gonna muck you up. I just gotta hope I wake up. If I wake up and pull a Shadow Sneak, I'm not sure I kill him. But I just like the prospect of maybe being able to. Actually, however, I, I think I'm better off just actually attacking with a gunk shot. I'll slow him and ruin him on a possible switch out. Gengar is always a prospect that I have to worry about, but... Brillum is not beating my muck, that's for sure. Unless he carries facade, which he has yet to show. Which I'm somewhat worried about. I'm worried about a lot of things. <laughs> he is thinking though, I like that I got him in a scenario where... Like, Gengar is his win con, but so is like, if Brelum is still active, it should be able to win him the game because of Mag Punch alone. There is nothing on my team that takes a Mag Punch right now, besides like Raikou, who definitely can KO it back. Um, and if Gengar comes in, I'm bringing Shensei. Stays in, goes for an Endure. Ooh, that's nasty. Wake up. Oh, it's not pretty. I have to wake up next turn. Like, 80% chance, 85% chance. Yeah, gotta do it. Oh, seeds. Now I wake up. Nice! Get wrecked, son! No more Brilloom! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Can't seed me. I gunk you. <laughs> Alright. So, Gengar probably comes in now. Yeah. And I'm gonna let, not let him seed me. So I'm gonna bring in Shensei mainly as a deterrent. Uh, if he goes for Psychic, I should be able to take that. If he goes for Shadow Ball, should be fine too. He goes for Focus Blast. I mean, it's still on my TNI. It's not like I'm crying over the loss of it. There we go! I just, for the life of me, can't remember his last Mon. <laughs> but we should be able to have speed here. Even if it's Scarfed. If it's Sash, then it's just an unfortunate event. Three minutes left. Bring me it! Absolutely dying. Oh. Yeah, it was sashed. Should have known. Okay, what's happening now? Cursed body? Yeah, that's not helping. Thunderbolt. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's not a strong lad, that's for sure. Um, no, did he DC? No, 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 we're still in this. Gonna fang him then. If I'm gonna fight Cripple, then I might as well fang him. What are you last man? Sukun, oh yeah! Oh yeah. So, I s oh, of course we miss, right? Um. Right, we're facading here. I mean, in, in theory now, there is really nothing I can do versus Sukyun. I mean, if it's Call Mind variant, I mean, I'm <laughs> straight up lost anyway. I'm kind of glad I died to um, the poison, though. Gotta hope it's not... Like, he can't stall through this, which is great. But if the rest sleep talk, roar... No, couldn't have roar. It all depends on the set. 
but I mean my best play now is probably just bolting yeah he'd wrap up the game it's not like we got a lot of minutes left in us and if it has mirror code the more power to my opponent really yeah, it's still a little right call mine yeah it's fair 60 seconds left. So I need to bank on a crit. Because in theory, I can like call mine, stall him if I need to, want to. This is a matchup he can't win in the long run, as he is in pressure. Maybe I should just show him I got to call mine myself. Just to kind of. Ha! Nope. Two can play that game. You want to play calm? I play calm. Let's go. Let's try this one more time. So the game is not going to get con concluded, unfortunately. But him showing protect means it doesn't have rest. So it means that he'll lose this matchup anyway. Yes, I know you guys both have leftovers. You're a bulky cat. Now let's hurt each other. Come on, buddy. Get him. Boom shakalak! <laughs> Alright, so the game ends here, but yeah, clearly Gengar isn't outspeeding Raiko. So, GG my opponent, what a fantastic game. Well done. Hope you guys enjoyed this game. I mean, it came down to wire, didn't it? And uh, yeah, I'll see you all in the next video. Until then, as always, guys, take care, alright? Bye.